Hi there, ukulele friends. I've been chained to my computer station here for two days between work and editing and stuff like that, but I have something really fun to share with you. This is up on YouTube, but it's not up up on YouTube. We're still, it's still a work in progress, but I'm pretty pleased at this. I did a collaboration with Lisa Webb. It's been a long time coming. We've been sharing files back and forth and doing the editing, but uh, I'm just really happy with the way this turned out. I like to build a world home and furnish it with love. Grow apple trees and honeybees. There's no one There's more. to good Just wait for it, wait for it. I like to teach the world to sing. Zip to the end because it gets it gets even crazier here at the end like this. So anyway, be looking for that. I hope to have that out by Saturday. We'll have all parts and the tutorial's been filmed and all this. So that's been really exciting. Um, I taught my class on Saturday, my um, $6 and above patron class, and we did three John Prine songs, and I filmed the play-alongs for to go with them, which are behind firewall. You can't see those on YouTube unless you're one of my patrons at that level. But I, I just got a bug to play with it and changing changing the key and usually I don't use a capo but I put a capo on just because I was trying to do these little ornaments with a D so here's the question I have for you and see if you agree when I put the capo on the instrument just doesn't sound as good it sounds muted the strings don't seem to ring as much and even when I threw in that little ornament on the picking, because the strings don't ring as much, it just kind of like dissolved. It, it didn't shine, it didn't pop out. But the key's a lot better for my voice. So I think, uh, I think I'm just gonna have to figure out another key to transpose it into where I can still do like a little one finger ornament on it and have it sound cool. We'll play that for you here at the end, and I hope that your day is going well. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do that. It helps my channel, particularly the tutorials rise to the top. So uh, do that for me and do that for the rest of the ukulele world that you know somebody might want to learn the slow way that I teach. Until next time, bye-bye. <laughs>
Yeah.